Right, ladies and gentlemen, coming at you with an emergency video because apparently we're hearing about GTA 6. The trailer. Apparently the insider came out and we're talking about Tom Henderson. He has been very credible in the past with Call of Duty, Battlefield, even uh, uh, GTA 6. He was the first guy to say that we're going to be having like a massive uh, Lucia Bunda. Uh, or maybe he never said that Bruh. or something. But he did say that we're going to be having one male and one female protagonist. Okay, I remember he said that. And quickly after we ended up seeing the gameplay getting leaked out and you already know what's real and what's not. But now he came out once again and it is a little bit suspect drop a thumbs up if you want to see gta 6 uh, trailer this year dislike the video if you want to see it like in 30 billion years from now but let's guess right into the news we're gonna be getting into the story because this is insane now he actually came out and says that everyone keeps asking me when gta 6 will be revealed and i don't know Wait, what? Bomba cut! That's truly wild, but then he says that I'm going to assume, based on the past reveals, a reveal trailer would be last week of October 2023. Now, he is assuming, okay? So this is like prediction, he's not saying anything, because previously, he came out recently and said that GTA 6 trailer is gonna be happening this year in 2023. Obviously, a lot of people started asking him about it, and now he's saying that if he has to take a guess, it would be last week of October 2023. But however, we're hearing about their investor call, right? I want to dive into that in a second. Last week of October 2023 or first week of November 2023 before Take-Two Q2 2024 earnings call. And then he responds by saying this. A 2024 release will probably be given then inevitably delayed until 2020, 2025. That's where I kind of disagree also real quick there was a man who got arrested for training his dog to throw bricks at people ringing his doorbell and if you happen to be the guy that was underneath you need morgan and morgan if you're ever injured or you know someone who's injured and you do not know where to start morgan and morgan is easy when you're injured in an accident hiring an attorney is one of the first things you should do and with morgan and morgan submitting a claim is super easy more than three million people have trusted morgan and morgan when they were injured in an accident and the best part is that they do not charge you unless they win the kiss for you <gasps> if you're ever injured in a car accident or at your workplace you can check out morgan and morgan you can submit a claim in eight clicks or less without having to leave your couch that's right for more information you can check out for the people.com or dial pound law that's five to nine on your cell phone or you can check out the top pin comment below as well that's where i kind of disagree because i feel like the annoying rockstar track record and you guys can correct me if i'm wrong as well because as as a man i'm always wrong. wrong if you're a man you're wrong okay i guess you already know that only strong independent are always correct but la la ladies and gentlemen the situation with rockstar is that they usually like to reveal and announce their games two years before for example, GTA 5 announced in 2011, came out in 2013, I believe it was delayed as well. Red Dead Redemption, if I'm not mistaken, announced in 2016, came out in 2018, but was actually delayed. So in a way, I guess he's kind of right. Yeah. So they can announce for 20, uh, announce it this year and announce it for 2024 and then re uh, release it in 2025. But if I have to take a guess, they're gonna announce it this year, but still, uh, say it's coming out in 2025 and then they can delay it to maybe 2026 2027 I I really Bruh. hope that doesn't happen okay that would truly be insane but however I want to get into this one current gen consoles market by 2024 will be sufficient enough to make GTS 6 the hit it needs to be but I think they won't mind giving the market another year and ensuring the same is the best it can be. There could be news earlier, of course, but I'm not basing my predictions on any insider information. Just looking at past announcements and what would make sense. Please do not come after me if I'm wrong. wrong. And essentially, Take-Two is going to be doing their investor call on February the 6th. And he's apparently saying that I do not expect anything to happen there. But I want to remind you this, though last year okay last year february 4th it's gonna be one year one year this coming february since they have officially announced that many of you have been asking about a new entry in the grand theft auto series i mean bomba cut a year guys a year god damn it yo can you get more information it, there's a possibility that they might reveal maybe come out with a tease or a teaser anything that goes down i will surely cover for you i will be live streaming so hit the bell and click on this video on the screen because rockstar is dead ass teasing with a bunch of images click on this video on the screen or click the video on the left because this guy thought he was playing gta 6 and this is a very brutal cop chase in real life click on that and i'll see you right there